Hey, what's going on, family? It's your brother, L. L excels. Excels the game. Excels my name. And make sure you brothers go ahead and excel today. Hit that thumbs up and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Now, I want to talk about why you're thinking negatively when it comes to you getting back in the dating market. When it comes to you, you know, approaching girls and you feel like you got to be the nice guy. Like, no. No, guys, don't fall for this trap, okay? People would try to shame you and tell you, oh, it's bad to be yourself. It's bad to be masculine. You know, girls, you know, this is a new age. Girls want a guy who's, you know, caring, sensitive. I, I'm not saying you can't be a loving boyfriend or whatever you want to do, guys. But at the same time, she's only going to like you and respect you when you have a masculine frame. And people forget that, you know, people feel guilty for, you know, treating someone a certain way, you know. You know, be masculine. Be like, be masculine. It's taught to be like, oh, that's not a good thing. Why, why are you acting masculine? Like, no, you shouldn't feel like that. You, 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 you got to cater to everyone's feelings. And no, don't, don't fall for that. Okay, that's one of the biggest mis misconceptions that's out there in the world right now. Okay, be yourself, bro. Like, the thing is, guys, I want you to just really stop thinking so much. Okay, yes, you want to think logically, and yes, you want to make right decisions in that sense or matter. But when it comes to you. You know, being yourself, being like just happy, guys, and being like who you want to be with these girls. Just be yourself, bro. Talk about things you like. You know, if something doesn't align with you and she says something, hey, speak up, okay? You know, for example, you know, a girl might say, oh, you know, Nissans are better than Honda Civics. Or, well, I don't, I don't really care. Like, I don't, like, I don't care to hear it. You know, I'm just going to say my input. And, you know, it's true. Girls like that a-hole. Girls like the guy who's, you know, an, an a-hole, okay? They don't want the guy that's just like everyone else, you know, not himself, he's a sheep, he's afraid to speak up. Like, no, you gotta be yourself, bro. Like, be happy being yourself. Be be masculine, bro, be be bold, man. Don't feel guilty feeling bold, okay? Because think about it, you know, if, if she's living with the safe guy, if she's with the nice guy, like, he doesn't excite her, okay? Life's boring. Girls want that, you know, that constant craziness, guys. They need craziness, okay? Some of you guys fail to realize that. But girls, they need that emotional roller coaster. And I already know I'm going to have people in the comments saying, no, bro, you need a steady relationship. Or I'm going to have girls say, oh, my gosh, you're toxic as hell. Like, it's not being toxic, bro. It's talk. It's like, guys, like, she she wants that. She wants to, you know, feel like she needs the ups and downs with the guy. She needs to feel great. And then there's times she's going to have to miss him. And there's times you're going to have to go, you know, to show her you're, you're that dog, that animal, bro. Like, who the F cares? Just be yourself. Be happy doing so, man. I don't want you to feel ashamed to, you know, do what you want, okay? If you want to date multiple girls and that's what you think you need to do, then hey, I, hey, make your own decisions, you know? If you want to be with one woman, ain't nothing wrong with that too, bro. You do what you want. That's the that, that's the beautiful part. You're a man. You make your decisions, okay? And, and you, you stand by them and you live by them, okay, guys? Like, don't feel ashamed. Don't feel like, oh, I'm a bad guy because, you know... You know, I, I'm, I'm treating girls, you know, I'm just joking around with them, but they might be, people might be sensitive. Like, guys, you got to realize most people in this world are sensitive. They're weak, scared, not bold. Uh, they, they lack testosterone, guys. They lack that, that masculine presence. They, mac, they, they can't, even, people can't even look people in the eyes anymore. Have you ever noticed that? You ever speak to someone? Like, you spoke to someone and, you know, they can't look you in the eye. Like, it's, it's weird, bro. It's weird energy, okay? Like, be bold. Enjoy doing what you want to do. Okay, like for example, okay, most people, you know, they say, oh, you got to take a girl out on this dates and these many dates for her to even give you a first kiss. I don't believe that, you know, if you want to, you know, try to escalate things uh, quicker than most normal guys, then hey, do so, bro. That's your primal instant nature to do it. Okay, you just feel it in you. You feel like, damn, like he, he's a, like, I'm a man. Like I got some. I got urges. I got. I want to do what I want to do. I'm gonna to try to let her know what it is, guys, because I see that. I know I get comments where guys are hesitant. They tell me, "Oh, I'm, I'm hesitant to, to approach a girl. I'm scared. I'm scared I might get rejected. Uh, she might not like that. I might look like an a-hole. Uh, people are staring at me. I don't want to, you know, approach a girl in public because you know she's afraid of me. Like, like no, bro, don't be afraid. Be, be yourself. I love being yourself, bro. Like you need to be yourself. Enjoy talking. Enjoy putting yourself out there. You gotta love it all, my brother. You can't be one of these guys who plays it safe, okay? Because when you play it safe, it's just you'll never get what you want. You gotta be bold. Take some chances, okay? That's what makes you. That was. That's what makes you attractive in a girl's eyes. You know, when you're able to take a chance, guys. The, the, when you take chances, you know, it, it, it can be fun. Like, don't ever play downplay that card, bro. Like, take a chance. Be yourself. Enjoy it. Like, 
That's the thing, guys. They want, people want you to feel ashamed to take a chance. Like even like for you to go speak to a girl, you know, we got people on TikTok recording you. We got people just low key obsessing over you, you know, like, oh, what's this guy doing? We got to pay attention to him. Let's see him fall. Let's see him get rejected. Like, screw them all. Okay, you got an audience, man. That means you're a king because people pay attention to someone's important, who's important, okay? Screw it. Be that guy who's like going to take that chance because I'd rather take that chance. Guys, think about it. It's like playing baseball, right? Where's my bat? Ah, it's not even with me, but, okay, it's like when you take, it's like when you play baseball, bro, like, I'd rather go down, if I'm going to strike out, I'd rather go down swinging, you know, at least trying, you know, having confidence in swinging than to just look by and have that opportunity pass me right by. Like, I'm not with that, bro. Don't be with that. Don't be with that lame energy. Go go out swinging, bro. Go out swinging. Okay, you can't play it safe. The guys who play it safe, guess what happens? They don't ever speak their mind. And then guess what? Then you become the dinner date guy. You become the guy who, you know, girls are going to take advantage of. You know, the guy who doesn't get the text back. You know, the guy who gets ignored, dub crap like that like no be the guy who you know you take a chance you say what you say you you mean what you say and you do what you want to do bro like don't feel ashamed be yourself don't be you know caring about what other people do guys because when you care it just leads to trouble it leads to you know bad things guys because you're going to be so emotionally invested you'll be too afraid to take a chance guys like that's the thing too you gotta learn to get become de like unattached from bad situations like you know, don't don't feel bad when, you know, this happens or, you know, you know, life's unexpected, bro. So, you know, take it as it comes, pause. But, you know, as life approaches you, don't be afraid, bro. Like, don't you can't go around living life scared. Like, you'll never feel like yourself when you're scared, when you're afraid to speak up. Like, no, don't go down that road. I've been down that road plenty of times, guys. There was times where I let opportunities pass me by, whether it was job opportunities, talking to girls, you know, even like when I wanted to start YouTube in the first place, here's the best example. Like I used to be so scared to post videos, guys, back when I was in college. Like I was so afraid. I'm like, oh damn, people on my campus might see me and just think I'm awkward. And like, who cares what they think, guys? That's the thing. Once you realize, like, none of no one around you, the, the surroundings, they don't matter. What matters is between you and yourself and how you see yourself. Like, guys, you have to go to sleep at night with decisions you make, okay? Good or bad. So, you know, if you made decisions, guys. I'd rather have you guys, you know, be confident in your decisions. You know, sometimes we mess up. You know, the thing is, we got to pick ourselves back up. We don't have the luxury to just crawl around all day and just, you know, just let life, you know, just stomp on us. We got to go out there and attack it. OK, it's a beautiful day to be alive. Go out, go do something positive, productive, energetic. Get yourself out there. Become more social, guys. I want to see you guys excel every day. If you made it this far in my video, make sure you like and subscribe to the channel. Follow my Instagram and my Twitter down below. If you ever need a consultation, guys, reach out to me. Like, that's all you got to do. Reach out to me. I will schedule something. I want to see you guys excel. I want to see you guys level up. Do what you got to do. Boss the hell up. Don't care what anyone else is doing. You do what's best for you, my brother. Let's excel today.